Many people want to lose weight quickly. However, fast weight loss can be difficult to achieve and even harder to maintain. If your goal is to lose weight then remember that losing weight isn't necessarily the same as being your healthiest self. There are many other ways to pursue health. Exercise, sleep, and other lifestyle factors play a major part in your overall health. Diets have always played a crucial role associated with weight loss. Be it long-term or short-term, although some diets may not simply work. We can provide you with all the facts about diet trends and weight loss methods, but at the end of the day, it is up to you and your nutritionist to decide what works best for your nutritional needs and goals. In today's video, we'll talk about what is the Dukan diet and what are its pros and cons. Before we start, quickly subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon so that you don't miss our videos every time we upload one. Let's get started. What is the Dukan diet? The Dukan diet is a low-carbohydrate, high-protein, weight-loss diet program that is split into four phases. It allows 68 low-fat, protein-rich foods in the first phase with 32 non-starchy vegetables added during the second phase. The majority of calories and nutrients on the Dukan diet come from protein, which is more filling than carbohydrates and offers fewer calories than fat. The plan also encourages physical activity, particularly walking and taking the stairs instead of the elevator. Unlike other low-carb diets, the Dukan diet is also very low in fat. In the 1970s former French physician, Dr. Pierre Dukan, got inspired when an obese patient said that he could give up eating any food in order to lose weight, with the exception of meat. At the time, the primary diet prescribed for weight loss consisted of low-calorie, small-portion meals, which was difficult for his patients to follow. Dr. Dukin shifted to focus on lean protein, which reduces hunger and makes the diet easier to stick with. Over the next 20 years, he continued to fine-tune the diet. After seeing many of his patients experience impressive weight loss results through his diet, Dr. Dukin published his book The Dukin Diet in 2000. The book was eventually released in 32 countries and became a major bestseller. It reportedly helped people achieve rapid, easy weight loss without hunger. The Dukin Diet shares some features of the high-protein, low-carb still-man diet, along with the Atkins Diet. This diet starts by calculating your goal weight, called your true weight based on your age, weight loss history, and other factors. Prior to starting a new diet plan, always consult with your doctor, especially if you have an underlying health condition. What to eat? Each phase of the Dukan diet has its own dietary pattern. How long you stay in each phase depends on how much weight you need to lose to reach your true weight. The Dukan diet is split into the following four phases. Phase 1. Attack. The first phase of the Dukan diet lasts 2 to 7 days, depending on how much weight you want to lose. The diet refers to this phase as pure protein days. The attack phase is primarily based on high protein foods, plus a few extras that provide minimal calories. Phase 2, Cruise, the second phase begins as early as day 2 of the diet or as late as day 8 for people under medical supervision and lasts for up to a year. During the cruise phase, you will continue to eat the foods in the attack phase with specific vegetables added in. This phase alternates between two days. Other than in salad dressing or for greasing pans, no fat should be added. Phase 3, Consolidation. Once you reach what Dr. Dukin calls your true weight, the consolidation phase begins. The length of this period depends on the amount of weight you have lost, with five days of consolidation for every pound lost. In this phase, you can mix and match any of the foods from the attack and cruise phases along with the following. Fruits such as berries or chopped melon, one medium apple, orange, pear, peach, or nectarine, or two kiwis, plums, or apricots. Bread with a small amount of reduced fat butter or spread. Cheese. One or two servings of starches per week, such as pasta and other grains, corn, beans, legumes, rice, or potatoes. Meat including roast lamb, pork or ham one or two times per week. Two celebration meals per week, including one appetizer, one main dish, one dessert and one glass of wine. One pure proteins day per week, where only foods from the attack phase are allowed. 2.5 tablespoons of oat bran daily. Phase 4, Stabilization. The final phase is the weight maintenance part and lasts indefinitely. Here, you can loosen the rules as long as your weight remains stable. There are a few principles to follow like. Use the consolidation phase as a basic framework for planning meals. 
Continue having one pure proteins meal day every week. Never take the elevator or escalator when you can take the stairs. Take 3 tablespoons 17.5 grams of oat bran every day. Pros. The Dukin diet is effective for the quick weight loss concept. The plan allows unlimited amounts of lean protein, which decreases the hunger hormone GHRLIN and increases several fullness hormones, so you end up eating less. The diet also has a long consolidation phase, which helps with the transition from weight loss to long-term healthy weight maintenance. Weight loss in and of itself can offer health benefits for people with excess body fat, including reduced risk of weight-related disease. Though the Dukin diet has been widely criticized by some health experts as an unhealthy eating plan for weight loss, many people have had success following this plan. Cons: The Dukin diet has strict rules. The primary concern with the Dukin diet is that it restricts several foods which may lead to deficiency of nutrients like vitamins, minerals, and phytonutrients. The diet restricts vegetables to low-starch varieties but allows fat-free dairy, which is high in sugar and carbohydrates. Also, eating too much protein may lead to health complications, including cardiovascular disease. The liver and kidneys have to work extra hard to process the byproducts of protein metabolism and there is a limit to how much protein the kidneys can filter. Dr. Dukin claims that drinking lots of water will solve this issue, but he doesn't provide any scientific references to back this claim. Additionally, high-protein diets also affect the environment. Animal farming leaves behind a substantial amount of carbon footprints compared to crop farming. Many environmentalists encourage eating less meat and more plant-based foods because crops produce fewer gas emissions and lesser impact on the environment. Is the Dukin diet safe and sustainable? The Dukin diet has an entire week of eating only protein followed by alternating days of protein only. Many health and nutrition experts recommend that for sustainable weight loss, creating a sustainable calorie deficit is important. Recent research has found that high-protein diets aren't harmful to people with healthy kidneys. But people who tend to form kidney stones could see their condition worsen with a very high-protein intake. If you enjoyed the video, quickly smack the like button and share it with your friends. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you do not miss our upcoming videos. Bye!